Okay, so I just got my Ring Video Doorbell 2. And this is uh, going to be a setup video on how to set up your device. And we're going to work on the installation at a later time. But for now, we're just going to look at what we have inside. Alright, little manual. And a few other pamphlets. A little protected by ring sticker and some FCC guide. Um, corner mount, wedge mount. So you get two mounting plates, one is so that it'll angle it up a little bit or down, another one that's angled so it, it'll angle left or right depending on how you mount it which we'll get into later. I'm just showing you what's in the box, um, the doorbell itself, some installation tools, we've got a screwdriver, uh, mounting hardware, a little level, a couple wires, a drill bit, we'll get into that later. Uh, more mounting hardware, a USB cable, and another faceplate for the doorbell itself. I guess you can have it silver or black whichever way you want, whatever your preference is. And more mounting plates right here. All right, so that's what you get in the box. Number one. Okay. Charge the provided battery. So I'm just going to charge it with my computer, but uh, all you do is connect your USB cable to either a plugged in cable or to your computer and slot it in here and it starts charging. Orange, two lights and then once it's charged it turns all green. So we'll let that go for a while and once it's fully charged, we'll be back. Okay, so got the green light, looking green. Just unplug this. Don't need that anymore. And so the next thing it says to do is install the battery. So Take this cover off, just pulls apart, and setup button says that's there, and there's something inside here. Uh, battery tips, I guess these are the security screws for when we go to install the thing, but for now we're just setting it up, like it says in the manual. So insert the battery this way, I presume, till it clicks. Okay. All right. Download the Ring app. All right. So I have an Android. Okay. So just go to your. Um, Google Play Store and okay now search for the ring app ring app ring app okay install Shouldn't take too long. Okay, it's installing. Okay. Open. Okay, so create an account.
in your last name. United States. Continue. Okay, type in your email address. Okay, retype email address. Okay, now create a password. Account created. Please check your email to continue. Okay, so now let's check our email. Okay, I don't know if you can see this. Here. Please verify now. Verify now. Okay. Now let's set up your location. Continue. Okay. okay, type in your address. There we are. Okay, done. Confirm address. Okay, set up a device, doorbells, doorbell, allow, scan your code on your ring. So here it is on the back, boom. Allow ring to access this device's location. Okay. Continue. Okay, in my case, I'm going to put this on the front door. Oh, now it's saying take off the place plate and remove the battery. So take the battery back out and put it back in. Okay. There it goes. Continue. Okay, press and release the small button on the top right corner. Press the reset button by the sticker. Continue. There it goes. Okay. Is the light on the front door of your ring doorbell two spinning? Yes. Go to Wi-Fi settings for your mobile device and join the network. The spinning white light means your ring video doorbell two is getting ready to connect with your phone. Which Wi-Fi network should your Ring Video Doorbell 2 connect to? In my case, West Eros. Just pick your own. Enter your password for your Wi-Fi. Press continue. Your Ring Video Doorbell 2 is now connecting to West Eros, which is my network. So whatever your network's name is, it'll show up. 
congratulations setup is complete okay now it's updating we know you can't wait to try out your ring doorbell too but please wait until the light stops flashing okay I've waited a while and the light is still flashing let's go ahead and press continue anyways okay so while it's updating it asks you do you want to install your ring video doorbell 2 later I said yes and then it sends you an email on how to install your ring I'm not gonna go over installation at this point we're gonna do that later okay internet connection test now we'll test to make sure your doorbell 2 and phone have healthy internet connections start test Success! Your doorbell 2 has a solid internet connection. Done. Okay, now we're going to walk through some motion detection settings. Okay, press the button. Are there steps or a hill leading up to your door? No. Does your door face a street? Yes. How far is your door from the street? I'm just going to say 15 to 30 feet because it's close to, it's about 30 feet, but let's try that. Okay. Continue. How often should front door capture motion and send you motion notifications? I'm just going to select standard for now. Okay. We'll try that at first. See how that works. Save. Changes take effect the next time this device detects motion. Got it. Okay, now let's add another user. Okay, so I'm going to add my wife. Done. Okay, now let's confirm your address. Front door. Live view is off. Alright. So, let's see if I can see myself. To see camera previews, turn on live view. Enable live view. Okay, push the front button on your front door. Okay. Someone is at your front door. Loading. Allow. Wow. That took a long time, but uh, there I am. All right, so there you have it. Okay, hang up. Okay, here you're probably going to want to add the protection plan, which allows you to view the videos that have been recorded, which is pretty much the whole point of the doorbell in the first place. Um, it's like two bucks a month or something like that, but for me it's worth it. Um, but again, it's up to you, whatever you want to do. All right, so that wraps up the setup part of the Ring doorbell. Um, now we just have to install it. In my case, 
we had removed our doorbell. So I had to do a um, just a straight inline installation, which is a little different than most um, installations. If you're interested in learning about how I did that, Go ahead and subscribe to this channel. I'll be posting a, another video on how to install it without a doorbell. Just a straight line from a transformer to the doorbell. So it bypasses your doorbell that you have or don't have already installed in your house. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up. If you didn't, just press that dislike button twice. All right, we'll hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.